the snacks. Let's go. So it's just gotten super cloudy out of nowhere. But anyways, let's go and get some minstrels because I've missed them. Let's have the first one together. I'm so excited. Minstrels are my favorite, favorite chocolate. Mm. So good. So I'm gonna put this battery on charge, eat some more minstrels, and I catch up with you when I have something else to eat. So the first meal of this epic cheat day and eating whatever I want is going down right now and obviously I had to start off with a McDonald's, of course. So starting off with my usual order, double quarter pounder of cheese, plain, I don't like any sauce or salad. And then we have two lots of fries here because we've got other meals, put them one to the side now. And then of course, cork zero because it is the best pop from McDonald's. Pop from McDonald's just hits differently. Let's have a couple of these fries. I'm literally so excited right now. Mm. That is so good. Oh my. These are cooked very well as well. Crispy, plenty of salt in them. Unreal. Now pop after the salted fries. Honestly, this is just hitting on different levels right now. The burger. Let me give you a little juicy. Oh yeah, that's it. It's gonna be a good one. That is lethal. Look at that. This is better than I remember. I've got how thirsty you get from eating McDonald's because you're I feel like, um, you know, when you're a kid, you like suck one on the glass, that's what I felt doing there. So we're going there now, finish watching Desperate Housewives, eat the rest of this meal, tastes absolutely unreal. <laughs> As you just saw, I've cut some dying pieces and I put it in this new 12 flurry that you can get off the brand new menu at McDonald's. They didn't put that many 12 pieces in, but they put a lot of chocolate sauce. That's why I've added the dying pieces in. Giving it a good stir. Now, ooh, let's give it the old taste test. I'm pleased about the dime pieces in because I'm only getting a hint of like 12 here and there. But this is very good with dime and the chocolate sauce. This 12 one with chocolate sauce, 12 pieces and dime pieces is a solid 9 out of 10. My next snack are these Max Paprika Crisps. I haven't had these in the longest time. I always have them with meal deals. Let's give these a try. Look at the oranginess. Oh, this is gonna be so good. Mm. Because he's so cute, I'm gonna have to give him a crisp. I'm maybe gonna be nice and give him a big one. Mm. 
Is that nice? Is that nice? Yes, it's so tasty. Tasty. So here he approves of the tasty snack as well. I'm gonna give him one more because he's super cute. Yes. And then one more for me. So I know I've already eaten loads of miniatures but I don't care because I can eat wherever I want today and I've edited a few videos so why not have a few dimes, yes. So I'm going to have the first one with you and then I'll just put it on a time lapse while I'm editing. Mm. So good. So I've got loads in my hand here, there's loads on the couch, I can't fit them all in my mitt. It's like Pringles, when you have one, you just have loads. I am jealous. This one is my fiance's biscoff one. This is my crunchy one. Hers looks so much better than mine. I am very envious right now. I wish I would have gone for the other one. So we're having these skin on salted fries for Mr. B's. They're literally so good, so crunchy. Got obviously some Peronese dip, of course. As I was saying, crunchy is so good. Having these for tea, then after it's got some cakes and shakes to show you. Mm. So I quickly nipped into the kitchen to let you know what's going on with the milkshake. So I've just had this, it's a crunchy milkshake as you've just seen me having a sup in there. It's so good. This is honestly a nine out of 10. I don't know what actually could make it better, but I feel like maybe it's a little bit more crunchy and it'll be a 10, but it's very, 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 very good. We're watching Desperate Housewives, so I don't talk in there and make lots of noise. And the box of fries I showed you earlier, me and my fiance were sharing them, putting Peronese on it. And to be honest, I say sharing, I ate most of them. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, they're very good. It's super crunchy, salty, honestly, so good. Let me show you this dessert, good. And there was a mix-up in the shop. I said Biscoff, I thought it was a Biscoff dime cake in one, but it turned out that it was two separate things. So now I've got two cakes instead of one. Not bad, let me show you. They look absolutely sensational and I was meant to do like a nice little edit of the milkshake but I'll be honest I was, <laughs> I was so excited to try the milkshake I've got to give you a nice little thing so if it wasn't that great in there <laughs> apologies I was just way too excited I will have a quick bite of this now I'm gonna go for the dime one first I think I have a quick bite now because I'm gonna go back in there it's a dime cookie dough slab how am I meant to get my mouth around <laughs> this huge It 
It is nice, but I'll be honest, the cookie, like it's meant to be cookie dough. It isn't cookie dough, it's actually like a crumbly cookie. It's, it's not like melted on the inside. It's a little dry, um, but the dime's nice. I'd probably just give it like a 5.5, 6 out of 10. That's actually quite disappointing. I'm gonna give the lowest one a bite now because that was a little disappointing. Yeah, the Lotus Biscoff one is much nicer than the Dime. I'll give the Biscoff one probably like a 7 out of 10. Because again, it's not like cookie dough. It's like a crumbly cookie. But the flavour and the textures are much, much nicer. So yeah, I'm going to probably give them the Biscoff one now. I'll show you a few little snippets of me eating it. But I'm watching Desperate Housewives. So I'll catch up with you in a little bit. So I'm getting a good way through this now, but I'm starting to feel sick. I actually went for the dime one instead because it's toffee on the top. The more you bite into it, the more I really like it. It's still not cookie dough, it's still just like crumbly biscuit, but the toffee is very, very nice. But I'm gonna finish the video up here now, so I'm gonna finish this and then just lay on the floor and feel sick for a while. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. The cheat days are back, and if there is anything you wanna see, let me know. Take care, stay safe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Wow, bye, let's go. Yeah.